Hello everyone, this is Eddie the Magic Monk. In this lesson we're going to introduce you to the geometric sequence. Now last lesson I talked about the arithmetic sequence and that was when you had a sequence of numbers mm -hmm. that increased mm -hmm. by the same amount every time you go to the next number. So 3 plus 4 is 7, 7 plus 4 is 11, 11 plus 4 is 15 and so on. This sequence of numbers was called arithmetic sequence. Um, I think in America they pronounce this some other way so if you're from America um, good luck with the pronunciation but um, geometric sequence is slightly different because instead of adding on a number every time to get to the next term we multiply a number so for example let's say the first term was 3 again but we times by 4 every time okay so 3 times 4 is 12 12 times 4 is uh, 48 48 times 4 is 192 and so on so this sequence of numbers is what we call a geometric sequence okay so what are the things that we need to know for a geometric sequence well it's sort of similar to arithmetic in that we need to know what the first term is so 3 is the first term so we're going to give that the variable name a and we also need to know the factor that we're multiplying by every term and we're gonna call this um, R okay and the formula for the finding the nth term in a geometric sequence is therefore TN equals A times R to the power of so you can see that this 3 is the first term so that's t1 so t1 is just a times r to the power of 0 and this 12 is t2 which is um, 3 times 4 to the power of 1 and 48 is t3 which is 3 times 4 to the power of 2 and so on so whatever we multiply um, r uh, to the power of this number here is always one unit less than n uh, the nth term that we're trying to find so uh, we're just going to write m minus 1 in the formula so that is the uh, geometric sequence formula that you need to memorize so if somebody said okay what is the fifth term going to be in this sequence so we can easily use the formula so t5 is equal to a times r to the power of 5 minus 1 right using this formula here so t5 is equal to 3 times 4 to the power of 4 so putting that in the calculator 3 times 4 to the power of 4 and the answer is 768 so the answer is 768 which is the same as you can see in this sequence if we multiply this by 4 we will get 768 as well. 
Okay, so that is a quick introduction to geometric sequence and the formula for it, which is this. Hopefully you guys now understand where the formula comes from and I will see you